this don't put should be red but don't put it like that okay if you want to charge for two years you should multiply it by two so for this case if I want to offer two years I'm gonna put bring up the calculator here right 9.95 times 2 19.9 dollars okay so what you need to put here is 19.90 dollars like that and so forth three years four years and so forth and you can also offer a discount for example if you want to offer 10 years it should be 9 99.9 99.50 right 10 years time 9.95 time 10 so if you want to offer a discount you can offer this for for example 95 dollars or something like that okay and make sure you paste it the same thing okay F but for me for my eat memo service no I'm just gonna offer an annual domain registration and ask my clients to renew each year so I'm going to use that and uh, click save changes close the window now do the whole thing with .NET and .org okay Let's do it real quick here 995 Save changes, close window, dot org, save changes, close window, and dot us. Let's see how much I'm getting charged. Same price, right? And for dot ca, I'm getting charged 15 bucks. So for dot us, I'm gonna charge the same 9.95 you can define your own pricing but I don't recommend putting up your domain pricing so high because you can't just make a profit out, out of domain names and you just have to make it low so people will have or will see a, a, a competitive pricing out of your domains they, they will be convinced that your hosting services will have a competitive pricing as well so for .ca for Canadian domains. I'm be I'm being charged um, fifteen dollars. So I'm going to charge maybe nineteen dollars for .ca. Okay, put it here and save changes. Close window. Save changes, and there we have it. Now, okay. Once you've done this, the last part is go back to setup and general settings on the top go to domains let's bring the duo board over to the right again here and I'm gonna use new so I can point things out to you use red so here domains okay click on that 